State police are still searching for answers now one week into the Castleton homicide investigation. Channel 3's Cam Smith recaps where things stand tonight. Since police released the sketch of a person of interest wanted in connection to a Castleton murder, students here on campus say there's still a sense of unease. It's a crazy thing that happens. I feel like, especially around Vermont, like I wouldn't expect it to happen here. There is stuff that goes on, but never like that. The investigation into the murder of former Castleton Dean Honoré Fleming remains active. On Thursday, police say they received more than 150 tips after this sketch was released to the public. The man they're looking for is described as white, 5 foot 10, with short red hair. He was last seen by witnesses wearing a dark gray t-shirt and carrying a black backpack headed north toward the Castleton campus. For some, like University Associate Dean Matthew Patry, they're still mourning the loss of one of their own. It's been a sad time, of course, for many of us who've been here for a long time. We knew Honoré and really, you know, uh, felt dearly about her. But still, with no arrest in the case, Vermont State Police say the person of interest should be considered armed and dangerous. In response, Patry says students are walking around campus in groups and watching out for each other. But it's going to take some time. Uh, and obviously, if we can get um, some sort of resolution to this, things will get back to normal in a much quicker fashion. Vermont State Police say uniformed troopers will continue to patrol the area. And Patry says with events on campus this weekend, the Rutland County Sheriff's Office will have a presence. Vermont State Police say if you have any information related to the case, they want to hear from you. In Castleton, Cam Smith, Channel 3 News.